Hey there, this is a video on how to submit payment via your ProPay account um, for your customers through either a text or an email. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go to your log into your Mary Kay and Touch site and um, go to ordering, scroll on down to ProPay and log in. And I'm going to stop sharing for just a second till I log in so the world doesn't see my um, login. Okay, I'm going to go back to share screen. Okay, so this is my ProPay account. And, um, and so I want to, I have a customer. I want to send them a payment link. Okay, so this is really, I've been doing this a ton, especially with customers that, like with the charcoal masks, and it might be people I don't even know, and they, they filled out their survey, and they've ordered a charcoal mask. Um, so I have their, you know, their address and everything. I might be shipping it out to them or I might be um, delivering it to them. And I want to have payment, especially with you know, people I'm shipping it to. It would be nice to have payment before I have to send it out. So what I'm going to do is you just need their name and their phone number or their email, whichever you're going to do it. And then obviously the amount that you're going to charge. So you're going you're gonna to log into your ProPay account and via in touch, And then you're going to go over here to um, process a card. I didn't mean to double click that. It doesn't matter. Um, shoot. You got to process a card. You're going to see here it says send a text or email invoice. So this is really awesome because instead of having your customer leave, you know, you really don't want them to leave their credit card on a phone, a voicemail, or you definitely don't want them to email it or text it because they can all be um, retrieved by other people. So this is a great way that you can send it straight to their phone or their email and they can literally pay securely straight to your ProPay account and it goes right in your ProPay account. So you just select here either email or text. You write their, their first name, their last name, their email if you're doing it via email and if you're doing it via text, it'll say their mobile phone number here and then the amount. And of course the amount that you're charging them is, is whatever the total amount is, you know, with tax and if you're charging shipping or not or if you gave them a discount, whatever the amount is, you put it there. And then what I always do here is I just put like MK um, because I don't know if it's something that they see on their end, but I just do MK and then I put the person's name um, just so they can see and I know who it is when I'm going back through and checking everything. And if you want to, you know, I put a note and says thank you for your thank you for uh, your business or thank you for supporting my business or whatever you want to say, you can. And then when you're done with that, you just hit submit. And then there's like another another window that will come up that says, are you sure that you want to submit this? And you just say yes. And then they get an email or a text on their end. And they just submit payment. And when they do, you'll get an email saying that you had a ProPay, um, a ProPay payment done. Now, the cool thing too is, is when you do, like I've had lots of these going out, right? And so you want to make sure you're getting paid, right? Who, is there anybody that still owes you money or whatnot? So you can come up back up here to your regular ProPay account and go to View Reports. And you can scroll down here and see pending email invoices, okay? So here you can kind of see I have some people that are still, you know, still outstanding, all right? And like for this instance, this person here, Sharon, she wrote me a check instead. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit cancel request so it's not pending anymore because I know a check is on its way, okay? So you can cancel a request if somebody changed their mind and paid via cash or check. Um, but you can see your pending email, email invoices right here of, of who still um, you know, owes you. And um, so that way you can follow up with it. And then also you can also see re reports. You can see completed transactions. So, you know, you know, you can always go in and see, oh, yeah, I already charged them. You know, like if you, you know, sometimes you get a lot of business going through. You're like, oh, my gosh, did I send them one? Did I, did I charge them yet or not? And you can kind of see right here who, who has already, these are all completed transactions, so you know. Okay, so that's as simple as it is. It's super duper easy, and that's another really great thing about ProPay. So I wanted to share this with you guys, and um, happy selling.